Pasteris 2 makes sustainable aviation possible by developing the technologies of the future. We want to reduce environmental impacts by introducing new materials, introducing new processes. For example, hydrogen, tanks, system integration and lightweight design. To define which materials we want to test and characterize them. We really want to create a new product and prototype which flies. And setting up the architecture to enable hydrogen propulsion. And faster it's too, we focus on the fuselage and, and the tails of the aircraft. For hydrogen propulsion, we need to find a place uh, for the hydrogen tanks. That's going to be close to the, the rear fuselage and the tails. That's going to change the shape, it's going to change the structural arrangement. And we have requirements. We need to think about other solutions. And then we have to build the complete uh, airframe completely new. And then to combine it into a new fuselage and empennage that is able to, to have the new hydrogen combustion. These solutions that we want to put in place by 2035 will be lighter, less noisy, will use less fuel and will be much more sustainable for our space. FASA H2 in specific is how we bring new tank concepts in an aircraft in an industrial way that you manufacture at the end of the day. Not only one demonstrator, we really need to think how we can manufacture this kind of new aircraft. This is really urgent to act now because we need to start building all the technology bricks that will allow for this uh, in the next years. I really like this project because the consortium is formed by several partners from the whole European community. I'm aware that it's a great challenge, but we will do it because we are working closely to achieve the goals between the different European countries. So as a kid, I was always fascinated by those big airplanes flying. And now, as I'm a part of this consortium, it's really great for me to be able to shape the future with with a view of sustainability. So I think it's a dream come true in many ways. Uh, now we can do it. We are starting, we are starting a new way of designing aircraft and possibly other things. Uh, ideas that seemed like a dream 20 years ago. And now we are in a, in a position to, uh, to, to test them and develop them. So here in this project, we have the chance of shaping the future. <laughs>